So the other day I broke the world record for the longest spinning DNA with this one-up yo-yo. And I did it using this technique I pioneered where the DNA goes very, very slowly. But a lot of people didn't feel like that really looked like DNA, so that got me curious. I couldn't possibly beat my 32 second record with a full speed DNA, right? You never know till you try. That was a good throw. All right, so uh, we're using the same yo-yo, which is the one up, and uh, this is also cage-free yo-yo string, which is what I used before. It's actually extra long cage-free yo-yo string. And the reason you want it extra long is because that definitely helps uh, distribute the tension a little bit more. Um, this, is, this is actually kind of surprising me. It's going up a lot better than I expected. Now if I can bring it up to my hand, maybe it'll go away. Go away, go away. What just happened? 